Uh, I recognize a gentleman from New Hampshire, Representative Pappas, a member of the committee. The gentleman is recognized. Thank you very much, Mr. Chairman. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. While we fight the COVID-19 pandemic, we must continue to focus on economic relief and recovery for our workers, businesses, and communities. A major investment in infrastructure can get America up and running again. This bill is transformational and supports not only the roads, rails, and waterways across our country, but also the schools, housing, and broadband that connect our communities. This package will invest $1.3 billion in transportation dollars into my home state of New Hampshire over the next five years, creating good high-paying jobs and making long overdue improvements. This bill reflects the priorities I've heard about from Granite Staters, including the expansion of active transportation networks, increased funding for commuter rail programs, provisions for climate resiliency, and help for wastewater treatment plants to manage PFAS contamination. This comprehensive approach to infrastructure is critical to pave the way for our nation's recovery. I urge my colleagues to come together to support this legislation and a stronger future for all Americans. Thank you, and I yield back. 